This week in our behind the scenes series, I'm out at Towmaster Trailers where they make large trailers for machinery like caterpillars, bulldozers, things like that, as well as manufacture truck beds for snow plows and other truck machinery. And today for our behind the scenes series, we're touring this facility to show you how they make all those individual parts, piece them together and ship them out the door. But I would say probably 70% of our trailers are customized to one point or another. From single axle trailers, 60 ton trailers to snowplow trucks, Towmaster trailers and truck equipment are masters at their craft. For us, we've always taken the approach that we're going to be the high end builder. We anticipate what the customer needs for his product as well as high quality components are put into them. President Lenny Stoltz says the process starts by listening to the customer's needs. So the customer will approach the dealership with a need that they have and then the dealership will contact us and we will go from there and kind of help design and critique what might be the best recommendation for them. Once a game plan is set, blueprints for the project are designed, then sent to the production floor. Material comes into us in sheet form. We then nest them through a program, put them on the laser. It goes ahead and minimizes the scrap. All the pieces and parts are then divided out and put into pallets. After the parts are cut and collected, the tacking and welding process starts from putting on the axles to welding the beds. So we have this big fixture that assembles all the bed area. Once it's done, the main frame comes over, it's mounted on top of it. The whole fixture raises up and rotates and ends up with the trailer on its wheels. It then goes down through the assembly lines and all the various options are added to them. When the welding is completed, the trailer is then washed, inspected, and then sent to paint. Once they come out of the paint booth, we install the tires, let the paint cure out, put on the decals, the warnings, then they go outside and go back around the other area where they are then decked, and then they are final quality control inspections. Then the trailers are loaded up and shipped out. Stoltz says the process for building a trailer is also similar to their snowplow operations. So they've mounted the body now, they put on the cab shields, uh, all the hydraulics have been installed. Stoltz says their ability to grow and listen to new ideas is what separates them from other manufacturers. We are able to retain our customer base and so they come back to us year after year with also the need for a new trailer, but also with ideas what we should do to stay with the market and hopefully stay ahead of it. Reporting from Litchfield, Alex Wykowski, WJON News.